Unfortunately, uh, uh, many people that access health care feel stigmatized. They uh, will, might experience racism uh, or prejudice. And whether it's perceived or it's real, when you're experiencing it, it's very real. Have you experienced it? I, I have. I have experienced it. My great-grandmother was Clinket. She married uh, an immigrant. They moved from uh, the far northern BC into Saskatchewan, and they had a family. Greetings. My name's Morning Star Bear. I'm just going to say it. I'm emotional, so. Uh, <laughs> I'm Bear Clan. I'm Anishinaabe Métis from Treaty 4 Territory, and I want to acknowledge the territory that I'm in, Treaty 6 Territory, um, home to the Cree peoples and uh, uh, homeland of the Métis Nation. I also want to acknowledge my ancestors who are clearly here with me. <laughs> Barassa's great-grandmother was Johanna Salaba, who immigrated from Russia to Canada in 1911 with her mother and sister. She married Joseph Knizicek, who was also a Czech-speaking Russian. In a statement released after CBC's story published, Barassa reiterated that she does identify as Métis and she's hired a Métis genealogist to help her investigate her ancestry. She says the communities that she serves do not rely on, quote, blood quantum in order to assess who is truly indigenous. 